我们就要直接就开始等级，因为这个装的话，装装蛮久，然后。Oh, okay. Hi everyone, welcome to Crazy Live Stream. Good morning. Okay, firstly, we're gonna check our uh, our voice and video quality. Um, see uh, if any of you can uh, hear us clearly or not. Hmm. Welcome. Welcome. All right. Uh, so we are still waiting for uh, people coming, and uh, we have some internet delay so far. Uh, yes. Well, Let's see our like, new, uh, friend. <laughs> new, yeah, friend. new friend. Yeah, new friend. Yeah. Okay. We're gonna uh spend uh one minute uh for uh the time delay and uh for the people uh coming. Well, let's see some comments. First, First here. Okay. Wow. Wow, Korean language. Love quality. Thank you. Anihaseyo. Anihaseyo. <laughs> <laughs> Another printer. Yes, our new series. Uh, yes, uh, this is the uh, creative so cool. sermon D1. Sermon? D1. Yeah, I, I even don't know what sermon means. Sermon, okay. Anyway, so welcome wow. to our live stream. And uh, we will get started soon. Hello, okay, I'm buying uh, that already. Wow. You're fine. Okay, that's nice. Hi, our old friend. So uh, okay, in wait. today's uh, live stream, I. We will, we will do a assembly of this new printer and we will run some tests on it. So uh, if you have any questions regarding this printer, just uh, go ahead and ask. Uh, since the time right now is uh, uh, morning in China and uh, evening in uh, uh, North America, so what time in UK? I think it's uh, afternoon. Mm, yeah. Sleeping time. Yeah, sleeping time. Okay, so it's uh, uh, midnight in uh, uh, Europe. Good morning wow. from Canada. From Canada, okay, nice. Wow, the question is coming. Okay, so we will talk about the, the pr product information uh, during the assembling period. Uh, well, shall we start? Okay, I think so. Okay, if uh, we fin let's, let's fin finish all the comments first. Mm -hmm. The question is coming. Beautiful print size. size. Okay, so we will uh, show you guys the bed, the hot hot bed uh, soon. Hi, Miss O. Yes, we can. Hi, hello from Chicago, U.S. Okay. Hola, Spanish. <laughs> yes. Uh, so we got this mission. Uh, uh, for for no no like uh, preview. Well, uh. We just get it and uh, we uh, do the live stream. Yeah, okay. we can't wait to share you this new product. Yeah, this, yeah. This, this new new printer just arrived this morning, and uh, we are asked to do it do this live stream as soon as possible. That's why we are here at ten uh, ten o'clock. Hi everyone, what is that? Looks a well okay, uh, you can see it's uh, okay, it's here. Uh, Creality uh, Sermon D one. It's a new uh, type of printer, and uh, hopefully it can surprise you. Hi from Canada. Can I have it? OK, hello, everyone from everywhere. OK. All right, uh, we will start our uh, open box and uh, assembly. We uh, yes. invite our special guest, uh, our tech Mr. technician, Mr. Wu. Okay, now I will just uh, give this uh, box to him and let him, and I, I will just uh, do assistant with him, so help him to do uh, the assembling. And let's start. Yes, it looks too big. Okay, too yeah, heavy. yes, it, it's, uh, it's a huge machine. I mean, the machine size is large. Uh, well, it's a uh, printing size is quite uh, not that large. Uh, I bring my ruler uh, here. Uh, well, we, we can we can just have a, a overall look. So your this ruler is, a, is print by zero thirty. Yes, this wow, is three D so printed cool. ruler. It, this is one meter ruler. As you can see, I have the scale like one to one to nine in the middle here. So the package size. Is uh about uh less than uh 
300, so sorry, uh, 600 uh, millimeter. Well, it's over half half meter for the uh, length and the width. Okay, so it's kind of like a square. For the height, uh, the printer is about uh, 400 millimeter. Mm -hmm. All right, so let's, let's open it up. Okay, here, I, I, I will bring you to the center of the camera. Okay, you want me to Okay, you want to <laughs> Yeah. Open box is a very important, uh, you know, part of the, the whole process. First time. Yes. Um, just to feel um, the uh, opening uh, feeling. Okay, just be careful. Oh, okay. Open up. Yeah. So the printer is uh, well protected. Uh, you can see uh, well, we have uh, the form on the top. Now, uh, first layer goes off. And uh, secondly, we have the, I don't know, I think this is the door. Okay, we have two two doors on top. So these are the uh, accessory parts. So they can be uh, taken off easily. We have to assemble everything uh, later. So leave it aside. Well, next one, uh, we get. Okay, so this is all the covers for the uh, side of the printer. The it 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 is transparent. Just the, the white color is uh, the protector uh of film. Mm -hmm. Okay, next. One one more cover. Okay, we have a run out sensor uh, mounted here. Well, which is different from the uh, other 3D printers. Uh, the extrusion is uh, upgraded to the uh, different uh, shape and it is stronger and the most beautiful. Yes. Very smooth. Okay, we have uh, four of them. Uh, these four will be the um, corner of the printer. Oh, you can call it a pillow. Well, uh, this will be the. Okay. Well, this will be the uh, inside printer's uh, which and uh, one axis uh, extrusion. And we have all the small labels uh, here and somewhere for uh, you to easy to get uh, assembled. Okay. As you can see next, uh, we have all the main body underneath here. The first command will be the toolbox. I think uh, we have all the tools and the parts uh, inside it. So it's like a standard thing. Okay, well, we, we have more actually. We have a uh, uh, grease. And uh, some uh, uh, corner uh, protector, plastic. Okay, interestingly, we have one tape. Uh, it's just maybe for testing, print testing. Okay. Anyway, lots more thing here. We will show you guys uh later. Well, next uh, we have one uh, uh, test filament. This is a uh, two hundred uh, gram. Here you go. And uh, the manual. Yeah. Okay, I'll give the manual to you. You're gonna read it later. Yeah, yeah. Okay. 
Next, we're gonna take out the okay. Let's say the top frame. Okay, it's really heavy and a nice design. If you look at the detail, it's shiny and glory. Okay. So it's totally different feeling from other printers. And uh, if I flip it, as uh, you can see, the X Y uh, axis is uh, use the the um, the bearing and the uh, shaft instead of the belt and the roller, the the V roller actually. So it provides a stable movement when it's printing. The most important part or the feature of this printer will be the direct drive uh, extrusion mechanism here. So we will do a close look up on it later. So this is whole metal direct drive extrusion. We have a trans transfer board here. And okay, that's the overall look from the top. Okay, next. Well, uh, the next one will be the hot bed. As you can see, uh, now here we are. The hot bed size is uh, uh, not that much large. Um, okay, the size, uh, Yana, what's the printer size? The printer size 200, 208 by 208 by 310. Yes, exactly. Millimeters. Okay. Oh, no, sorry. <laughs> 208 by 260 by 310 yeah. millimeters. Yes. Okay. Print so the print size is uh, uh, mm, kind of smaller than the uh, CR10 printers. It's larger than the uh, NS3 printers. Well, if we look at the uh, details, uh, on the side, we have four rollers uh, to provide uh, a stable movement. Uh, and uh, What's more, the hot bed is on the bottom. I can see uh, it's kind of a standard design, but it uh, looks better. So we have the tempered glass. Well, uh, nothing more about this one. Next, uh, what, what's that? Okay, that, this will be the uh, base of the printer, wow. Wow. It's heavy and uh, looks uh, great. So uh, what we can tell here, this is a, a 4.3 inch uh, touch screen. Out oh, of oh, focus, okay, now it's okay. And uh, we have two uh, coupling for the Z axis. I think the motor is underneath here. So uh, this is the, the Upgraded uh, connection, connection, and all the cables come out from here. So this uh, this block is uh, the power uh, switch. So the uh, power cable will connect here, and here gonna be the on-off switch. If we look at the bottom, mm, nothing, nothing particularly. Just the black uh, sheet metal. And with uh, all the like uh, um, filters or cooling system, and we have four rubbers uh, at the lab. Okay, I think that's all the part of the printer. Okay, so we clean the space and uh, we will start the assembly. Now let's uh, view some comments first. Yes, let's see some comments. Okay, we will frequently check our internet. Hopefully, this time everything will be fine. Unlike the uh, previous live stream, we faced many, uh, you know, uh, internet cutoffs or similar situations. Okay. Oh, the question is Core XY. This is strong. not a Core XY uh, printer. They say the standard, uh, you know. Uh, Coordination uh, printer, like others. Mm -hmm. 
Does it have a lid top? Uh, if you are seeing the top cover, uh, what I can tell you is it is open on uh, top. So the top is exposed to the to the air. It is easy for us to uh, do the operation and uh, the observation. So it, it, it is not a fully closed 3D printer in a, another way. Very exciting for a new model. Will you be built it yes. today? Yeah. As you can see here, we will uh, do a assembling right now. <laughs> Where is that? Mm. A toaster is <laughs> it built? Is it easy to build this? This, this okay, let, let's yeah. see. Yes, uh, but it needs some uh, uh, assembling uh, skills and uh, patience. Yes, thank you. The print size 218 by 216 by 310 millimeters. Yes, right. Pre built. <laughs> Toast oven? Uh, no, <laughs> it is not. Can you print ABS filament? Yes, uh, yes of right. Course, of of course. course, they can pr print uh, ABS, PLA, TPU. TPU. This yes. is a, a direct drive 3D printer, so it can print flexible materials. Yes. Mm. So looks like the pre built comments the other streamers, but yeah, yeah uh, we don't know any other uh, streamers or uh, printer they are talking about. But anyway, uh, this is going to be the first uh, live stream for us to do the uh, Sermon D1. I still don't know why it's called Sermon D1. Direct drive? Yeah, it is direct drive. Yes, of course. right. What's the test model to print? Uh, we, to be honest we with you, I, I have no idea. I have to uh, insert the SD card and see what's inside. This is a, a literally open box. I don't. I this printer just arrived this morning, and we have. This is the first time we open it. I don't know what's inside in the in the SD card yet. Big size to print thing. Yeah, at the print size, I would say uh, it's not that uh, large, but it's uh, uh, a standard print size. This auto lovely. It is uh, as I uh, as I open, I don't see any BL touch or auto leveling uh, equipment there, so it is not uh, auto leveling so far. Yeah, this will already. <laughs> that question is he the boss? Yeah. I'm not. <laughs> that's so funny. <laughs> no, uh, the boss is somewhere in the office, not not here. Wow, looks a well sound. Okay. For uh, four points to get a flat. Flat plan with uh, three is no. easy. That's a, a interesting thinking. Uh, four four points. Uh. Of course, I, we, we all know three point designed a surface, but the uh, four point can uh, make it easier for people to uh, to do a detailed adjustment. But for three points, uh, you will have a rough adjustment in a lot of time in times. It looks qu uh, quite easy to assemble. Yeah, uh, let, let, let's uh, uh, do the assembling now and see uh, if it's easy or not. Nice size. Price, wow, yes, its price is very nice and beautiful. <laughs> 619 <laughs> US dollars. We include okay, go yeah. ahead. Yeah, we include shipping and the tax. Yes, okay, so we're gonna assemble it. Uh, and I will we'll put start. our link. Are, are we gonna read the manual? Yes, yes, we're gonna read the manual. So, can you, I, ha I have no clue. Well, are you confident? Okay, he said yes. He said yes. Okay. Firstly, uh, install profile. Now, it's telling us to install all the all the pillows on the corner. Okay. Shall we do it? Okay. 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 Okay.
One, two, three, four. They are they are same. So it doesn't matter which one goes uh, where. It looks very high quality, okay. yes. Good. You you you. Okay, then you're sure. Okay. Okay, so this is the front. Uh, let's. I will do. Uh, do they have a label on it? I think they are all the same. Yeah, it looks like that. But here it's different. Look. 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 When will it come to America? We are pre-ordered now. You can put put in this enter in this link. And the pre-order is limited. Hurry up. Okay. Dollars six hundred nineteen U.S. dollars pre-order price. Catch it. So we need the M six uh thirty five uh screw. Yeah, I read this manual. The print size is 218 by 216 by 310 millimeters. The machine size 500 by 500 by 531 millimeters. And the machine weight 20.5 kilogram. How long will it ship to America? Uh, now it's pre-order and uh, to your home maybe one month. One month, yeah. Uh, one question. What is the difference between this and the CR6 with the enclosure? Uh, I think it's not CR6, it's Ender6. And the difference is, uh, yeah. I asked Eli before, it's a direct drive and... Yes, uh, if you are saying uh, Ender6, uh, we understand, but do you don't have a CR... Okay, you are you saying the CR, CR6 SE or... Uh, uh, I, I think... Ender5. Ender6, yeah. Ender6 is a core XY uh, printer. And uh, it is a bundle direct bundle drive, not a direct drive. So this printer is a direct drive. Okay, thank you. And uh, they are look different. <laughs> it looks like toast. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
Let's see some details about uh, Sermon D1. Now it's pre-order. The price, 619 US dollars. And uh, ship 10 to uh, 20 delivery days. So it means you can get D1 in 10 to 20 days. New arrive, new innovation, Sermon D1. And this printer, you can do more DIY in this printer. Okay, next, uh, we finish all the uh, pillows on the four corners, and then uh, we will assemble the 2040 extrusion. Now we're gonna bring the, the hot pan. So we will put it aside first. Hmm. Okay, if you can tell, this is how it looks. We, we are going to do it now. Assemble the hot pan. Alright, next. Yes, we will put uh, everything uh, to the printer. Let's tell the front and we, we have a front. This is front. Okay. Okay. Yeah, now we're gonna uh, put the lid screw. Alright, so I'm gonna use a M4 14 screw. Beautiful. Is this a core XY printer? No, it's it's gonna be easier actually. So, uh, meanwhile, uh, do we have any questions? I can, I can see. Question: Minway power supply doesn't say in website. Yes, website. I, I don't have information on the manual either. So, I have to open it up. See uh, what's the power supply it, it, it is using. What is the difference between this model and the six core XY? 
Well, uh, if we look at the upside, the difference is uh, this printer is using a better extrusion and uh, the uh, structure overall. I mean, from the top to the bottom, it's used like a rounded uh, corner. So it is one feature of this printer if you care about the outlook. Uh, in terms of the mechanism, uh, I would say uh, this one is using a soft and uh, bearing uh, move, move, uh, movement or motion uh, drive. Well, uh, the Ender 6 is using a coaxy. Other than this, uh, the print size is uh, slightly different. So uh, this one, the Sermon D1 is a uh, direct drive. If you care about uh, printing uh, flexible materials like TPU, this printer is going to be the first choice. Otherwise, uh, you can use uh, the Ender, Ender 6. So uh, this two printer actually has uh, a significant difference. What is uh, heated by the maximum temperature? Okay, the temperature is here. It's a uh, hundred. So uh, the temperature about the hot bath or the or the nozzle, they are kind of standard, not particular outstanding features on them. Does it have an inclusion? Yes, it uh, has uh, all the acrylic uh, cover on the sides, uh, except the top. The top is open to the air. Why is it uh, limited? What is mean? Which uh, are you mean the quality qu quantity is limited? Quantity. Yeah. Okay. If the quantity limited uh, um, because the noise the pre order. Yes. Uh, uh, we have limited ready stock. Yes, we don't have many uh, printers in the uh, in stock so far. This is a new new printer. We are just uh, the manufacturer is uh, uh, in the process of making it. So we don't have um, well prepared uh, quantities uh, in the in our uh, warehouse. Mm -hmm. Leveling all the time, or it holds up okay? Yeah, I, I will check it for you. Uh, I think it's like other printers. Uh, once you do the leveling, or uh, one time you can uh, keep it running for one week of uh, printing, or uh, you know some period depend on how long you are using printer so it's using the standard uh not a level on the bottom so uh, it's no difference from other printers mm -hmm. all mental hot end oh uh, exactly uh the hot end okay the hot end you, if you see in the nozzle i think is standard uh copper but the extrusion mechanism uh, it's all metal. It's CNC machined. Mutation. How will you address them uh, run away, away and uh, uncommented nozzle heating in this printer? Uh, let me try to understand the question. How will you address thermal run away and uncommended um, nozzle heating in this printer? Well, I think it's more about uh, the firmware issues instead of the printer itself. Uh, it's, it's the main board, uh, actually, it's a main board uh, thing. Uh, this printer is using a mainboard version 4.3.1. I think this is a new mainboard also. Never heard about it. Next, okay. After we assemble the hot bath and the Z the Z axis, we will put the top frame carefully. 
Keep that in mind. Wow. Come here, come here. This is the front. So basically, the back is facing you guys. Not that hard. Right? Okay. Now we're gonna match some holes. Okay. Nice. Okay. So move the cable aside. Okay. This basically is the um uh, frame structure of this printer. Okay, so uh, we will put some screws on on the top frame and uh, show you guys the overall look. How does this compare the five plus and five, five plus. plus? Okay, interesting comparison. Uh, and the five plus, uh, I would say, uh, and the five uh, plus uh, has a larger print size. I think uh, two plus, three hundred thirty-five. Yeah, it's, it's like almost 370 uh, print size. Well, this printer has a smaller print size. Uh, and Ender 5 has a BL touch. But uh, uh, Ender 5 Plus is a traditional 3D printer as others. Um, it's, uh, uh, don't have, it doesn't have many new features like a direct drive or uh, the, you know, the uh, motion uh, drive. So if you are looking for something something new, this printer will be the one you are looking for. And the 5 Plus has been there for a long time, I think a couple of years already. All the, it was a, a great printer uh, during the old time, but uh, the thing is changing. So uh, we have uh, new printers coming out, and of course it's much better uh, than the old one. The price are similar, I believe. How big is the build fly? Build fly. Okay, uh, we will show you guys the front. Okay, this is gonna be the front view of the printer. Next, uh, what else we have? Okay, we're gonna connect all the wires. So the main table is going to the transfer board. Is this coax Y? No, it isn't coax Y. Will the price be higher after pre-realized or will you have a one for sale? I think a pre-order uh, price is a nice price now, and uh, we limited uh, sell this printer. Okay, all the wire connection is easy. What else we uh, we. Do we forget anything? Uh, before we put all the covers uh, of the uh, on the side, we will just uh, quickly uh, turn on the printer check if we forget any uh, installation or, or not. The power switch, okay. 
so quiet. Okay, okay. One one new feature of this printer is super quiet. The question: Do all the access? The, the the fan on the front is zero noise. I hear nothing. <laughs> are 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 we okay? Do do the other. Okay, we're gonna simply move the ax uh, the ax all the ax axis. Make sure it's uh, uh all the wire is connected. Okay. Why is it not working? Oh, oh, maybe it's going up. It's going up. Oh, this one. Oh, this one. It's going up. Okay, so all the axes are moving. Okay. Now we will turn off the printer and uh, put all the covers. All right. Turn the camera. Stop. Stop. This is the end. This is the end. This is the end. This is the end. Okay. Now, first day, we're gonna peel off all the protector. It's transparent color. Okay, it looks nice. This quality, like our um, LD zero zero two R, this yeah, it's it's similar well, actually. Similar, this printer, yeah. if you compare, you can compare this one to the uh two hundred B actually. Ah, two hundred B, yes. Yeah. Also, our new product. So uh, nice design of this uh credit. They put a sensor on the side, so it's not cutting our finger. So it's very uh nice uh, consideration. So this one, okay. This one is the back. Uh, we're gonna get the screws. Okay, M four. Okay, this one. Ah, you know what? So much. Don't use your hands. You don't use your hands. You 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 use your hands. The question is coming mental extruder. Yes. Uh, okay, so what we can do here, we're going to bring the camera to show you guys uh, the, the detail of this uh, extruder. This is one new uh, renovation. Wow, looks nice. So as you can see, uh, this is gonna be uh, okay. Let's go to the front first. This is the front view of this uh, mechanism. So uh, this motor uh it's standard standard uh, uh, extrusion motor and uh, this uh holder is uh made of aluminum and when we press it we can put our uh, filament in so this is gonna be the okay here yeah we have one cooling fan on the side first we have one small cooling fan on the front but don't uh or uh, look look down this this uh, fan. This is a, a super quiet silent uh, fan, although it's uh, small. So the one feature of this printer is the uh, soft uh, uh, soft and uh, the bearing uh, movement. So this provide a stable um, movement when you when when the printer is working. Oh, 
So it's never uh, vibrate or shake like the uh, wind roller. So on the side of this extrusion mechanism, as you can see, this is one cooling fan we talked about, and here on the on the on the back we have one uh, blowing fan. This is a large blowing fan, and uh, it has a long blowing uh, channel until it goes to the nozzle. Now we will move down and see the uh, hot end. It's kind of a weird angle, but... <laughs> so this is the bottom of the hot end. So weird. Okay, anyway. Uh, now we will just uh, quickly go over all the angles of this printer. So this is the back side. Okay, now let's uh, turn on the printer and see how it behaves. Okay, it's on actually. The front fan is running, but it's all quiet. Yes, it's super silent. Now you can see our screen is on. I'm not lying to you. Wow. Can you put that Google Phone on? It's really now we're silent. Now turn on the, the uh, blowing fan. The blowing fan is on the back. It's a, a standard blowing fan, so the noise is on. But it's still it's a uh, uh, quieter than others. So this side is the. Motor, okay. Not bad. Now mm, we will assemble all the uh, tower and the front door, of course. What's happening? Wait, wait is to twenty twenty point five kilograms. Yeah, it's uh, quite heavy actually. Henry said must be a hot product. Thank you. Is it bigger than the Sheraton S? <laughs> Actually, it's not. Sheraton S has 300 print size. Uh, this one is uh, less than 300. Yeah. Hmm? I have a silly question. Yes. Oh, go ahead and ask. Uh, uh, why it has seven coatings? It looks looks nice. Okay. It's a, it's also I mean it's a protection. Protection. Yeah, protection of, it, of from is... from children, you know, naughty kids. Okay. And uh, this this type of printers, um, I mean, uh, by ending all the closures or the uh, frame. Of course, it increased the cost, and uh, that's why the price is uh, uh, higher than the DIY printers. Okay. But uh, this will be a trend. You know, in the future, more print, more and more printer will be like this one, mm -hmm. because you can place this printer at your office, okay. 
you, you know, look, looks nice. And uh, also you can put this printer at your home when you, especially when you have kids. Okay. More and more so popular. Yes. Yeah, kids can see the printing process yeah. uh, outside, right? Yes. And cannot touch it. Right, exactly. More importantly, you can put this printer at school, you know, for education purpose. Okay, great. Yeah, it's pretty and safety. Question is coming. Eli, all that uh, firm and the Z axis is open as a top, no stability. Uh, at the at that frame and the Z axis is open at the top, no. Uh, uh, well, uh, I don't know if uh, why you're talking about stability. Stability. Well, uh, the print itself is super stable. That's all I can say. But uh, the only uh, short short uh, side about this one is uh, open the top. We don't have any cover on top. Maybe this is one uh, thing we, we uh, I mean, it's hard to print uh, high temperature material. But other than the open uh, top, all the movement, all the mechanism is super stable. Mm -hmm. Are there lights inside? <laughs> no. uh, in, uh, I, I would I would uh, I would have lights inside like a two hundred B, but uh, unfortunately we don't have lights. Hey, no, it it is a modified light. And yeah, put LED lights. I I think so. I think uh it can it, it can be modified to uh, add a light. Yes, you can do more DIY in this printer. So there's is no top cover. Ha. There is Wait. no top cover. Uh, you you, I mean, if you want to, I mean, you can uh, we can DIY one, but uh, unfortunately we don't have one. Okay. Uh, we have a filament guide actually. This one. So, uh, when the filament, filament comes from the uh, uh, run sensor, this one will just guide the filament, make sure it's not run uh, to anywhere else, and keep it in a, on, on the track. Since this is a direct drive, we don't have any uh, long tube outside. So this one is significantly uh, important, actually. This is how it looks. To, uh, Roller actually. Hot and hot and the top temperature. Hot bed temperature one hundred. Hot end. Hot end. Hot end. Hot end. Uh, no nozzle low. temperature two hundred fifteen degree. Okay, now we're gonna install the 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 front door. Actually, this is one feature. Okay, I ordered it. I ordered it. Yeah, we have, we have, uh, uh, have you see that? Great gift for everyone who ordered in our live stream. Yes, yes. Uh, today, if you, uh, in our live stream time, order this printer, we will uh, give you a, a surprise. Oh. Yes. Uh, yes. What's the, what's the gift? The gift uh, is... is 
Uh, filament, yeah. Why are filaments or extra glaze? It's up to you. Right. Yeah. So when you order it, send the order number to Yana or to Creality. So uh, this is one side of fr front door, and you can see it's well designed. Uh, it is, uh, uh, I don't know the term about it. So maybe it's not this one. I call, call it roller. Okay. We have a solid clip, and uh, make sure it's not uh, lose, lo losing uh, when we are using it. And we have a small uh, handle. That means this is a. Uh, let just move, move back to me. So this this door is gonna be go on this side. I will put our official store link. Uh, this uh, sermon D one in our comments. Well, if you order it uh, in our live stream time, we will um, send a filament uh, surprise, filament giveaway for you. Is it an all mental hardened? It is. Yes, all men, uh, all mental extruder. The breast asks, uh, does this take a standard or um, proprietary nozzles? Let me check. I think this this uh nozzle size is a uh, uh, kind of standard. You can use uh, any uh, nozzles on this printer. Let me let me check the um uh, spare nozzle. So we will know this is a standard nozzle. But after I assemble this stone. Great looking hang for the door. Exactly. Okay, uh, can you great looking hands? Hands. Okay, that, that's the term of this uh, uh, mm, item. It's called hand, hands. Hands. Okay, sorry. Hands. I learned a new word. It has a nice print size for an enclosed printer at this price. Yes, uh, people right. may uh, surprise why the print size is uh, uh, quite small. Uh, when we come, when we talk about uh, the enclosed printer, the the print size and uh, is always uh, smaller than it. Uh, I mean, should be since uh, we end up more features on the outside. So it's kind of uh, uh, we uh, have to limit the print size. Otherwise, the whole print size will be huge. Looks well some. What size is the build iron? The build uh, price is, oh, oh, yeah, no. A print size is 280 by 260 by 310 millimeter. Before uh, someone asked the, the nozzle, so I got a spare nozzle, as you can see, this is a uh, spare part. So by uh, looking at it, it's a standard uh, nozzle. I think it's number six, it's not number six, it's just a, a standard nozzle. Wow, that's nice. 
Thanks for the support. Yeah, so send the order number to Yana or Creality Team. Okay, so we will send you one filaments or accessories. Yes. Only in our live stream time. I have an interesting question. Okay, you asked an interesting question. Yeah. Eli, yes. give me three seasons to buy this printer. Three reasons. A reason, reason, <laughs> reason, three reasons. Sorry. Okay. Okay, let me finish this door and I will tell you some uh, why we need this printer. Yeah. Mm. Okay, basically if you are alone, you have to, you know, uh, spend more time on assembling, uh, but uh, hopefully your, your, your family can help you to do it. I think it, it is a great uh, family activity by assemble a 3D printer. Now all the covers is on, and uh, if we look at it, you ask three reasons why we uh, need this printer. One, looks beautiful. It's the one reason. Yeah. Okay, for people who care about true. the outlook, they are get bored of those you know ugly DIY printer, especially under three. So this printer gonna be the one you are looking for, or your family looking for, or your company looking for, or your school looking for. Okay, so here it is. Uh, nicely open the door. Welcome, join our live, uh, join our three D printer. Okay, just welcome inside. So this printer, Thermal D one, is one reason to buy it. Uh, the nice design and uh, great uh, outlook. Second one, direct drive. Direct drive will be the most important feature and. Uh, it was hard to, uh, you know, to to make actually. We uh, faced many challenge when we changed bundling to direct drive because it requires a lot of technologies and innovations. So this full metal, uh, you know, full metal or uh, extrusion. If you look at the website, uh, there will be a detailed structure about this uh, uh, part and. It is a new innovation. So hopefully it can provide a stable and reliable uh, print experience for us. We're gonna, we're gonna uh, run a test mode and see how it behaves. Next one will be, uh, uh, okay, the silent uh, main board, silent fan, and uh, the good print feeling experience. Okay. So now we're gonna install the, the spoon holder. Okay, I, I, I'll, I'll do it later because it's not an important part. First, uh, okay, the menu. We finish everything, we finish everything here. Okay. Okay. Okay, actually we, we should install this one first before I put the cover, but anyway, it's not a big deal. Uh, I'll leave it aside. Now, it's time to uh, run this printer. Firstly, I will uh, remove all the unwanted uh, 
the last page. And next, well consideration, I will put some tape on the surface to, you know, for, you know, any accident. I want to protect the glass uh, very well and use it for maybe 20 years. Yes. As you can see, the machine is on, but uh, can you hear any noise? Even I'm, I'm so close, but all I can hear is like a uh, uh, small, small, uh, you know, fly is running. Uh, and, uh, no, that, that noise is just, It's really very silent. It's yeah, so it's quiet. silent. So, so. Oh, no. Okay, you see it ruined. Anyway, it's the a demo. Uh, and this screen is color screen. Yes, it's color wow, screen. Wow, I like screen. it. Why is this happening to me? Okay, that's fine. Okay. Okay, put it one in the center. I think I'm done with it. Now, uh, I think I can I can do a uh, homing. Okay. The the Z motor is moving loud. I don't know why. But rather than this, is everything is uh, is normal. I will double check why the Z Z uh, axis. I think there are some friction when I assemble it. Maybe somewhere is too tight. Let's see some comment. Magnetic uh, removable printer surface, or it, is it a glass? It is a glass, not a uh, removable surface. It is glass. What printer speed can this printer accomplish? What print speed can this printer accomplish? Well, uh, we haven't tested it. I think it uh, is a standard. Okay, zero. Now I'm going to do uh, a um, bad leveling. So uh, I will uh, disable the motor. Okay, so uh, I'm at the Z0 position. That means I have to lower my hot bath. I may need a paper because the glass is reflecting light and I cannot tell uh, where, where. Small piece of paper. Okay, looks like the the nut, the lovely nut is uh, uh, squeezed all the way, but still the nozzle is touching the hot bag. I have to somehow lower the Z uh, limit switch. Where is the Z limit switch? Okay, thank you. 
Okay, but uh, it's fixed, it looks like. Okay, that means uh, what else I can do? I have to use the leveling uh, option to uh, do a conversation. Go, I will go just to down first. <laughs> the motor is noisy. Okay. But X, Y is okay. I think I have some Z motor related issue. Let me go. Uh, Okay, it's touching the hot belt already. What I can do is uh, I have to locate my uh, leveling, uh, the, the, um, what, the little screw. See what I can do here. Okay, so. Yes, uh, so the manual leveling is kind of uh, take some time and patience. I will do a rough uh, leveling, just, uh, uh, we don't want to waste too many time on it. But uh, if you have this printer, I mean for any printer, you, you need to do a uh, like, uh, careful and patient leveling. But for me, uh, I will just uh, roughly get it uh, done. Okay, because I can adjust the uh, leveling during its print in printing time. So. I will see. Here is the screen information. I think nothing special about about it. I will just go a quick uh, uh look. We have uh, print temperature setting. And uh, now I'm going to do a preheating. Okay, setting. We have a print information here. Is uh, uh, it telling me uh, it's third sermon D1 and uh, version 1.1.10, and the print size is uh 280 by 260 by 310. Okay. Now I'll get a uh, SD card. See what is inside it. So we have one standard SD card, eight gigabytes, and one uh um USB reader. Okay, we have some test models. Hmm. What's this one? Okay, this is the hours it uh takes. Let's go the nine hour. Okay. Oh no filament. Uh inside some filament. That means the run now sensor is working. Can we install a bill touch to it? Well, uh, I don't get any information yet. So from what I can tell on the uh, transfer board, uh, there is a place for additional uh, 
equipment or items uh, goes in. And on the uh, mechanic extruder, well, I have uh, two pre uh, pre tapped holes on the side. I don't know what's that uh, for. Maybe in the future we can add something on it. But still, I don't have uh, official uh, information. Okay, I'm gonna uh, raise up the camera. Okay, just now listen to me. I will uh, insert the, the filament. Let's see how easy it goes. Okay, it's straight, straightforward goes down. And uh, I, I can see uh, we have some material came out. Okay. Now, I'll click uh, yes. And now I start to print. Uh, firstly, gonna hit up. I did a terrible bad leveling. Uh, see what I can uh, make up now later. Paul asked, did you oil the road on the 3D printer? Oh, uh, well, uh, I assuming, I, I'm assuming uh, it is oiled uh, when it comes from the manufacturer. But uh, uh, they do provide, they do provide a uh, uh, extra oil box or, or grease for the maintenance. Yes, uh, you are saying why it's uh, noisy. Uh, I think this is one reason it's not oiled. But uh, anyway, this is just a live stream demo. I will, uh, I will do it later. It has some oils on it already. Okay, it's moving. Okay, I think I have to uh, do a leveling uh, again during this printing. See, hopefully there is a, uh, yes, the compensation. Okay. I'll just to slow down the speed first. I, I don't know what is printing, uh, since it's a test file.
Look, looks like I don't have uh, enough material. Okay, now it looks normal. Hmm. First task is the top, actually. Does it have a baby step? It yes, uh, it has a decomposition when you uh, do the printing. Okay, and the, the problem here right now is uh, the material is not sticking on the hot bath. Maybe I'll, I'll change a different color. It's still uh, printing. Spring is something. I'm not confident it's going to print well on this one. <laughs> print once, it's pro holder. <laughs> The first print is then easy for all. Yeah, exactly. Thank, thank, thank you for understanding. But uh, uh, I think I'm going to change the filaments. One of my N3 prints in the middle of the 48 hour print. So why is it a limited pre-order? Um, because our the first line to our oversized warehouse uh, is limited to America and uh, Australia. Then we will do more uh, line to Europe and the other country. This printer versus. Mm -hmm. It prints something, but uh, it's not uh, extruding, uh, ext uh, extrude uh, enough material, or it's not uh, sticking on hot bath. Okay, let me just uh, try one model. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, anyway, uh, so while it's printing, uh, do you have, uh, have any questions? What's the use of glass if the top is open? Uh, what is the use of the glass? Okay, uh, okay, I don't know which one you are saying. Uh, the um, top is open to the air, uh, and uh, the glass, you, are you seeing the hot bath glass or uh, Okay, you are saying it is useless uh, of the glass if it's open. Well, uh, the opening top is just uh, for the convenience of uh, observation and, uh, um, you know, do all the leveling and setting. I think, yes, uh, there should be uh, one update. Uh, oh, it will be better if uh, the top is closed. But let's see what we can do in the future. The first line is okay. So, Yana, uh, that's me. I can't pre order as I'm in UK. Uh, uh, sorry, I'm not sure. Uh, it may be a little de delay in the Europe in UK or not. Please uh, ask uh, our online, online customer service in official store. Thank yeah. you. To new isn't used with hours of print printing. Use glass have much ad adherence. Adherence. Mm -hmm. What okay, is so, it? Uh, well, uh, it depends. Okay, so for, to be honest with you, uh, the hot bath uh, is one uh, important part uh, when we print uh, any materials because it impacts the stickiness of the material. Uh, from uh, all the testing data, we can we can get the uh, temporary glass is one of the most uh, stable hot bath we uh, use for uh, 3D printing and. It is flat. It's, it is uh, flatter than any other uh, hot bath. Of course, um, it, there are many reasons impact the uh, printing uh, results. Uh, I would say uh, it is not that uh, uh, advanced. Many people recommend the PEI board. Uh, it is also one good choice. But I would say uh, hot bath is just the, the tempered glass is one standard uh, hot bath right now. You can uh, use uh, different materials uh, like uh, plastic or uh, uh, just a simple glass. It doesn't matter. If you have issue on sticking the uh, hot bath, you just uh, you change your hot bath or, or do anything other things. It, it, it is not that advanced. What is the use of side windows if the top is open? <laughs> Uh, I understand. Uh, wow. Well, um, actually, if you talk about the usability, the side window is not necessary, and the top window is more important. Actually, so um, for the side window, it's uh, more about uh, uh, make the printer uh, safe to use, and uh, make the overall uh, looking good. Why we don't have the top window is more because uh, we have all the um, cables or wirings and uh, operations on top. Okay. Does the nozzle move with the bed? Uh, no, the, the, the hot bed is stable. It is fixed. Uh, the nozzle is moving with the extruder. 
I think he means he thinks it fully includes the body is a fully included machine, is it? Uh, yes, I, I will not call this one fully enclosure machine. This is just uh, almost a fully enclosed machine. Oh, yeah. So the top, uh, which is the most important section, it is open to the air. If you are printing high temperature uh, material, this will be one limitation, I would say. But uh, it is easy to upgrade it. As long as we make some uh, uh, cover on the top, that uh, will not be an issue. So as a standard printer, um, why people didn't, why, why a creative uh, didn't uh, make the top uh, cover? I think it's just for the uh, cost saving and the convenience. Are you giving this away? Uh, today we didn't, uh, we don't have a giveaway event. Uh, but if you order this print uh, in our live stream time, we will send a uh, filament or accessory for you. No, uh -huh. controls direct direct uh, across the head and bed. Why get this printer instead of under six? Okay, uh, people ask. Uh, under six is a uh, uh, correct why. If you care, care about the speed, print speed, uh, under six is one good choice. But if you want to use direct drive uh, as this one uh, to print soft materials, uh, this printer is going to be uh, one a good choice. Well, now it's print, uh, printing uh, stably. Let it, let it do the printing. And I think uh, this is going to be our whole process uh, about this printer from open box assembly and uh, test a print. Uh, well, hopefully, this live stream can give you a general idea about this printer. And uh, in today's live stream, we don't have anything else to show you guys. Um, again, uh, to emphasize, if you purchase this printer during our live stream time, and uh, we have a special gift for you, an extra material yeah. uh, filament. Uh, so, uh, uh, honest uh, comparison with other printers, uh, people may care about the price. Uh, at uh, I mean, I wouldn't say which printer is better. Uh, this one, D1, and the uh, and the and the six, and the uh, and the five plus. They all they are they are all different. The price is similar, all within like a hundred difference. But uh, they have two. They have different functionalities and uh, uh, purpose. So it really depends on personal needs uh, for which one you should guy you, you should buy. Yes, and uh, I put the link uh, again. If you want to know more details about this printer, you can see it in our official store. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, now, okay. Uh, now. Okay. So. Uh, here is printing. Uh, well, uh, if you have any questions, uh, please ask. And uh, we uh, kind of close to the end of today's live stream. And hopefully, this live stream uh, can give you a brief uh, introduction about this printer. And uh, uh, you have a general idea uh, what it print, what, what this printer is, and what it can do, and what it cannot do. Yes, and sorry for more comment. Uh, maybe uh, something we didn't answer or read it. Okay, as okay. any other three printers, uh, the mainboard or the uh, printer 
does not have a Wi-Fi module. So it is the same, same as other printers. Okay, so uh, if you don't have anything else, uh, I will call it an uh, end on today's live. live. Okay, so uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, I will uh, say goodbye to you, yes. everyone, and uh, have a good dream. And uh, okay, I'll see you next time. See you next time. Happy printing. Bye-bye. Yeah.